Professor Liu is going to teach you uh, chapter A, classroom number five. Uh, create a C++ program that prompt the user to enter food order to a vector. The program print the order food from the vector. This example will be ideal for an online restaurant order. The reason is um, not a restaurant will ask a user to, uh, anyway, uh, a customer will order different type of food. Some two, some three, definitely are not, they are not exactly the same. So, so if you save the full order in an array, you will have the problem. Sometimes it's uh, not enough. Uh, most of the time you waste too much uh, space. If you say, oh, they have 20, um, most people 20. If a uh, customer order one, you waste the 19 spaces. Customer order two, and you waste 18 spaces. A uh, one customer has a party, so order 25. Then uh, your array is out of boundary. So this is not ideal way to do it. We want to do a vector. Okay, because vector is a one dimensional array. And the one dimensional array and also uh, flexible can grow and shrink. Just depend on your demand. So we're going to use this program uh, to do a restaurant. Okay, so let's do it right now. So first, uh, we need to have a vector. Include vector. That's a library. Now, once you have that, let's create a um, vector. A uh, uh, type is string. Now, learn this right now. For you use vector, the type is inside the angle operator. So it's a vector. So you type vector. Uh, it's a string type, so you put angle string. If that's integer, you put uh, angle integer and boom, okay? And no square bracket anymore is a vector. Any food you want to order, any food you want to order will be a string. So welcome to Viva Mexico Mexican food restaurant. Uh, in order to make this, uh, you understand, I just order two food first. What's your order? Get line, order one. So I get the first order and save into the vector. Your next order, I save into the vector. Then uh, I save, use pushback, okay? I can use pop back to display. But I want to show you another um, sp special function is special thing function is called size full dot size. So right now the size is two, and you use a uh, full dot size, and which allowed you uh, to retrieve the uh, these are zero one. Okay, let's run this program right now. So build it. Start rebuild it. And start without debugging. So, what's your order? Vector taco. All right. So, what's your next order? C plus plus burrito. All right. The food you order is vector taco. The food you order is C plus plus burrito. We are done. But we need to fix this program. Uh, it's not, it's not all program. It's not all program will use, not, it's not all customer will order two food. Uh, I'm sure, you know, people will order two, three, four, five, how many, right? So the ideal way is we need to use a uh, take order and we use a loop, do while, okay? So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to uh, delete this part. And I'm going to uh, take these two functions right here and pull right here, okay?
So, um, uh, I wanted to uh be able to use uh these two functions right now. Okay. So take order and print vector. Okay. So, uh, same thing. Welcome to Viva Mexico restaurant. Uh, restaurant. And I take order. I print order. And learn this right now. When I pass my vector, I pass the name. Food. All right. So when I take order here, I can do food exact same name, but usually we do food one whatever. Make it this easier. Do food. All right. So do loop. Now remember here because I I want to order because my compare is a single character. So here I cannot do a uh, um uh more than one uh, string because I'm using because look I am using y I'm comp I'm using um combination of character and string. So if I want to have multiple uh strings I better use a dash in between. Okay. So here I do a uh, string order again. So what's your order? You, you order one you know vector burrito and I save into your food array food array food vector saving to want to order another one so this will allow you to order again and again until you suppress type at y and we use uh we usually use other thing um um then um but now we try to use to compare to just try to do different thing and we print it all right the food you order okay so let's run this program right now uh with array with the uh, functions so i build it and i start with debugging as i told you because i'm combination of um uh, the character in string so i'm going to do what's your order okay uh vector or uh taco do you want to order yes another one uh c plus plus uh burrito all right want to order another one yes all right so um then uh so what's your order okay so that's a a, a large drink large program uh programming drink program drink Programmer drink. All right. Now we don't need. That's it. That's it. So no. All right. So press any key to continue. All right. So uh, let me see. Do I need to type it? So print order right here. All right. So that's your program. I hope you like this program.